Hey guys, it's your boy Jackie, and I'm back with the video. And today, if y'all cannot tell from the title of the video, my birthday is tomorrow, so we are here with like a sit down birthday video, whatever. So, with that being said, cue the intro. You guys are helping me take one step to get to where I want to be, and I, it's crazy. I, I love and I appreciate every single one of y'all. Yeah, so if you guys cannot tell from the title of this video, I have no idea what I'm going to be filming. And if you can't tell, I'm going to be honest, I haven't filmed the video in a minute. Um, it's been a while, and yeah, I'm going to tell you guys why. I guess basically today's video is going to be like a update video type of stuff and just talking about how I feel since I'm turning 22 tomorrow. So yeah, basically as the time I upload this video is going to be on February 22nd, the day before my birthday. So my birthday is February 23rd. So yeah, you guys should be commenting happy birthday and just texting me happy birthday or just telling me happy birthday. You know what I'm saying? I would appreciate it. Much love. Um, but with that being said, yeah, I was born on February 23rd, 2001. So I will be 22 in a couple of days. Yes, yes, yes. Get all them old jokes out the way i get it i'm old as fuck it is what it is ha 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 fuck you but with that being said in this video i'm just gonna be talking about some updates in my life and just stuff to this channel which you guys should be expecting and then just some stuff that i've learned at the age of 22 the old age of 22 so to start this video off we're just gonna talk about how i feel turning 22 um i'm not gonna lie i do feel old like my knees really be hurting um, like right now, my right knee has some knee pains. Um, I do feel old, like I feel confused as I'm about to graduate school. Shout out to me if y'all didn't know, I'm graduating this spring. Um, so I would definitely say I feel confused as I'm about to graduate and I don't really have a clear passion or motive anymore because as you guys can't tell, I feel like I've lost my motive to do YouTube. Um, and I don't know what made me lose this passion. Maybe it's because I've been doing it for a while and I've had little growth. Um, I think that could play a huge factor, but it's also just like, this is something I want to do. With that said, I want to put more effort into my videos, better quality. And if you guys can't tell, this video is being shot in 4K. You know what I'm saying? 4K. 4K. You know what I'm saying? Um, so we're going to just up the quality a little bit. Um, just make better content overall. Um, come up with better ideas, I guess. Um, just basically be a better content creator. With that said, I'm going to be taking some risk with my channel. I'm going to be putting more money into my videos. Um, yeah, my wallet is going to be hurting, but it's something I want to do. And if this is something I see myself pursuing as a passion and just what I want to do, that's something I got to do, make sacrifices. Like I mentioned earlier, I'm graduating this spring. So with that, it's very... It's a very, very scary and nervous time. It's also very exciting, but I'm gonna say it's very scary because I'm fucking terrified. After this, I'm an adult. I gotta pay real bills. Well, I'm moving back home, which sucks. Like, cause as a kid, I thought at the age of 22, the old age of 22, I would be like married with kids my whole career. I like, I guess I would have the whole shabam, you know? But since I have to move back home, I guess that's a little discouraging, but <laughs> Y'all think it's a L, but it's actually a W move. You know what I'm saying? W for what's wrong. But, you know, it's a W move because, hear me out. I don't got to pay bills. I save more money that way because I'm about to graduate school debt-free. And I get to make content and, like, I get to, like, take my sister's room, my room. And I get to have my own little office room and stuff like that. It's actually a W move. I don't got to pay for food. You know what I'm saying? All I got to do is just work. You know what I'm saying? So it's actually a W move. But realistically the reason why i don't want to move back home no offense to my parents i know you guys will never see this video but the main reason i don't want to go home is because i'm not gonna lie my house is very outdated and me living in college apartments living in student housing i had the luxury of like my own bathroom clean all this stuff like that going back home and like using some of the dirty stuff is gonna humble me but you know what i'm saying it is what it is i'm gonna make enough money one day so i can renovate my house for my parents but back to the video uh, my old age of 22, how do I feel? I just feel, like, emotional. Because I don't know if it's just me, but every single time, and it's that time of the year around my birthday, I always get so emotional. Let me know down below in the comments if that's just me. But I just feel like 
every single time it's like around my birthday i get more emotional i get more in my feelings um so i've had some couple bad days but i don't know it's just like i'm really about to be 22. i graduated high school four years ago i'm about to graduate college on time class of 2023 stand up you know what i mean um but it's just surreal i never thought i would be here i never thought after i dropped out i would come back and finish on time and so i guess i'm just proud of myself and also just like i don't know i guess I guess I wish I can get more recognition from my family, you know what I mean? Because I did realize the one thing I've always wanted in my life was to be loved. Um, and like, I came to the conclusion where I like, I was okay not being successful or whatever, as long as I just had someone to love me. And what sucks is that like, I guess I don't know how to take love because I know my parents, my family love me. I know how my friends love me. It's just, I guess the way they show it isn't the way I want it, I guess, because the love language and stuff like that. So I know they love me, but it's just, I guess my mind wins. Your mind is going to be your biggest downfall sometimes and it's been kicking my ass for sure. But with that being said, I just feel like I'm, you know, I'm just taking life day by day. I'm only worrying about things I can control. Um, I'm going to just live my life to my fullest, be myself, be who I am, be the genuine, true me. People don't like me, fuck it, you know what I mean? Like, I'm be honest, I'm a weird guy. Like, I'm a weird, goofy guy, I'm a unique guy, you know what I mean? Um, what you see on me on camera, that's what I am in real life. Um, so it just, I just be myself, you feel? So with that said, like, what else do I feel like? I don't really, I don't know, I don't know. If y'all want to see me do like a 22 things I've learned in my life for being 22 years old, let me know, I can drop that video next week. But it's just like, I don't, I don't even know, bro. Like, I, it's, it's, I guess it's sad to say this, but I never thought I would reach this age. Not because I'm saying like I would have died by this time. It's just because I guess I never really look this far like i'm deuce deuce i'm 22 years old you know what i'm saying uh stay tuned for my birthday post because as soon as that shit has 12 o'clock i'm posting a picture on instagram saying deuce deuce you know i'm sick with 22. i don't know it's just I, I guess i never really thought i would get this far in life i guess like i guess i don't know maybe just because i guess i never really celebrated my birthday i guess it's just another day um because like for Valentine's Day, for example, I've gotten numb to the point because I never had a Valentine's. Like, Valentine's Day is just another day. And I hate having my birthday, like, the week after Valentine's. is because it just makes me realize, like, how sad I am and how, like, I don't get no girls for Valentine's Day and I get no girls on my birthday. I'm not saying life is about girls and stuff like that, but it's just the lonely aspect of that makes sense. But with that being said, I also got to get out of that mindset of, oh, I'm single, no one wants me, because that's not true. Those people that want me is just a mindset and it's a bad mindset that I have. But it's just crazy. I'm really about to be 22. Um, I don't know. It just, honestly, it just feels life is moving fast and it's crazy uh my advice for y'all is just take life day by day and enjoy everything because time really do be flying as much as people don't want to admit to that time will be flying because it feels like yesterday um god it feels like yesterday i was just a freshman in college a freshman in high school and i'm about to graduate it's crazy time really do be flying but it's like i don't really regret a lot of things in my life let me stop the cap. I really do regret some things, but you know, everything in life happens for a reason, and I'm here. The man I am now is because of everything that's happened in my life. I could definitely say throughout my time, throughout my old age of being 22 years old, I would definitely say I've learned a lot from my mistakes in my life, and I'm not perfect. I made plenty of mistakes. Um, so if I could teach you guys anything is that we are all human. None of us in the world are perfect. We're all going to make mistakes. So if there's someone out there that you know that thinks they're all perfect, 100% perfect, like, honestly, cut them off because they're not worth it because they think the world revolves around them. But, like, no one's perfect, bro. We'll all make mistakes, and that's okay. We're human. We're allowed to make mistakes. The only thing is that we're human. Make them mistakes, and you got to learn from your mistakes or at least try to grow from your mistakes. Um, but with that being said, like, that's really it. I just feel... 22 is coming it's around the corner and i'm old honestly though i really am just excited to see what the future holds for me because i know what i'm capable of i know i have a whole bunch of bad days but i just know that i'm put on the surface to do something great and i just can't wait to see what i can achieve in my life i'm just excited what the future holds for me but now we're moving on to the second part of this video where i'm going to be talking about what i have planned in the future so me and my friends, we've been talking about starting a group channel 
called three guys one camera y'all could check that out right here that's just like we don't really have anything set but y'all should just go help us out and go subscribe um but yeah basically that's just gonna be a channel where me and my friends are gonna mainly be doing a podcast but also just doing other group activities funny videos and stuff like that y'all should definitely stay tuned for that because we are working on that and i'm going to be mentioning it or putting it in my video if i didn't actually have faith in it so i'm just praying and hoping that my friends are as motivated and i have like they're driven like me because i really want to make this work because this has been my dream for a long time where i've wanted to make a group channel uh, and just make videos with my friends because that's always seemed like a fun thing Ever since, like, the Sidemen, bro. I've been a huge Sidemen. I love the Sidemen, you know what I'm saying? I'm on the dick for real, but I definitely inspired to be like them. So with that said, stay tuned for that. I also got some big projects coming. I know I brought back the gaming channel, and I need to get back on that. Um, that's my fault. I've been slacking. Life has been kicking my ass. Um, but I'm, once I get that stuff rolling, once I graduate, really, it's gonna, I'm going to get stuff rolling and rolling and rolling and rolling. Um, what to expect on this channel? Just expect some travel vlogs. Expect some videos you know what i'm saying just expect some better quality videos i'm really going to try to take the knowledge that i learned in college where it comes to filmmaking because i want to become a better filmmaker not only just a content creator but a filmmaker where i could be able to make cinematic shots better b-roll footage um better vlogs better just everything you know what i'm saying i just feel like i could do better you know what i mean i'm going to do better so just stay tuned for my content because i have some stuff that i want to do it's just i want to achieve it and yeah, basically right now, I'm really just focused on myself and what I want to achieve with my goals, my weight goals, just everything in my life. I, re I really just feel like I'm just the main character in my life right now. And, and just stay tuned because I'm bringing you guys along my journey where I'm the main character in my life. And I just hope as I grow, it helps you guys become a better version of yourselves because that's all I want y'all to be is just be yourselves. You know what I'm saying? Just become the best version of you that you possibly can be. But with that being said, I'm probably... With that being said, I probably don't know what I'm entitled to this video. I don't know how long this video is, and I don't know if this video makes sense. Um, but yeah, I guess basically this video is just an update video on me. Just, you know, basically getting you guys to tell me happy birthday because, you know what I'm saying, I, I love love, you know what I mean? So give me all, give me all your love. Um, but yeah, with that being said, I'm just excited to see what the future holds. I've been having a lot of bad days lately, but... I've been having better days, and hopefully we can keep having better days and just taking baby steps to move forward in life and stuff like that. But with that being said, I am sorry for the slacking in my content. I feel like I definitely, definitely, definitely needed a little break. You know what I'm saying? Because I've been uploading every Wednesday for a, over a year now. And definitely, it's, I'm not saying it caught up to me. It just felt like a, a motion that I was doing, like a, a, a select motion that I was doing, just basically getting by, filming stuff. Um, but yeah, we're finally here, finally just doing better you know what i mean so we're going to do better and that's just point blank period so i do once again apologize for my lack of not lack of uploads but but once again i do apologize for the lack of quality that have been in my videos i'm going to be putting more quality into my videos so with that being said this is going to be my last update video for a long long time just because i feel like you know i don't want no more update videos because these are boring these don't get views i want to make better content that you guys can enjoy. So hopefully this will be the last one for a long time. And yeah, I have nothing else left to say. So with that being said, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Subscribe, share your boys out.